Hello everyone, Argon Matrix here. Welcome you to episode 11 of Let's Play Diddy Kong Racing. And... Uh, I'm sorry. All the spirit just got drained out of me because I realized that we're pretty much in the hardest section of the game here. The Silver Coin Challenges in Dragon Forest, like I said last episode, are very challenging. And then everything after that is pretty challenging too, so... Oh, we're in for some serious shit from here on out. We seriously are. Especially loading the second race against Smokey and the Whiz Pig race, of course. Uh, but I think before I do the Whiz Pig race, like, I'm gonna do the Smokey race, then I'll do all the trophy challenges, all four of them. Because you do need to do those for a certain thing to be unlocked. And then I'll do the Whiz Pig race, so that is going to be. <sighs> oh, look forward to that, I guess. Because I am most certainly not looking forward to that. Okay, but can let's see if we can beat this this time. Because I honestly like out of all the silver coin challenges, I think this is like the th this is like the second easiest in the whole Dragon Forest here. I think the easiest is probably Boulder Canyon because that course is generally easy, except the time trial is kind of hard. Someone mentioned that in the previous comments the comment section of the previous video. Yeah. I honestly don't remember the time trials too much. Didn't have trouble with too many of them. I remember a few. Alright. Oh, yes, I can... Yeah. When you see that target appear... Like, I just, like, whenever whenever I get the magnet, I usually just, like, to hold down Z. And then when I see the target appear, I just let go of Z and it'll pull you. It's usually how that works. Of course, sometimes I just let go of Z just because my finger gets lazy. And then I totally lose it. Alright, so here is the last coin, and I'm in second, so I think I should be able to do this. Especially if we get a homing missile here, then I... Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna forego that zipper inside the windmill over there and get the homing missile instead. And of course it hits the windmill. Oh, just my luck, you know. Okay. Come on, we got this. Turn right. Dude, oh, I just stopped talking all of a sudden. What, what am I doing? This is Let's Play. You have to keep talking. Even though there's nothing like nothing to talk about. And there, there really is nothing to talk about today. It's been pretty a lazy day. It's been pre a pretty lazy summer. Dude, I'm not going to win this. What? How could... No. I just realized that. that I'm like... Oh, crap. Come on. Come on, bumper. Slow down. D d oh, crap. Oh. I don't want to make this like... Just all this video. Just this one race. But I'm... That might be what happens, I'm not sure. Alright. see if we can at least stay ahead of Bumper here. Like, seriously, Bumper beat me? That's just dumb. Alright, pull, pull, pull! Let's go! Yes! Alright, that was a smart move. Very smart move. Uh, yeah, it is actually a pretty good strategy. Like, if you have a magnet, then the second someone passes you, use the magnet. Because then you'll keep up with them and you might, like, kind of like drafting almost. You just... You just pull up right behind them, and then, um... Then you pass them. Alright. Something that annoys me, too, is, like, in, like, these silver coin challenges, and, like, the trophy races, and whatever else, in, like, Adventure 2 and stuff, all these characters, like, your rivals, they seem to get more of a boost from the zippers than you do. In normal races, they get, like, it seems the same amount of boost. And that's why it's, like, almost essential to use the, um to use that green boost, the one that I call really cheap. It's pretty much essential to use that uh, when it gets to these silver coin challenges, but it's not entirely essential, I know that, because I've, I've beaten this game without ever using that, so. Oh, it's very hard, and but it is possible. Okay, where am I missing that last coin? I think it's like right at the very beginning, that little valley area with the two lakes on the sides, you know? Two little puddles. Alright, I'm going to pick up a speed thing, actually. Alright, oh man, I didn't hit that zipper. I think, you know what, if I think I hit the d d d talk, okay. I think if I hit that zipper, that might have been what, like, won me this race. Because I am, like, right on his tail here. I'm right on his ass. But I just can't catch up to him. What is this madness? 
It's absolutely ridiculous, man. I might just eventually just break down and use that freaking like green flame boost or whatever it is. Oh wait, I'm, I am catching up though. I have a chance. Slim, but I do have a chance. If I can hit him with this, then I might just... Come on. No, no, no! <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm going to have to start cutting some of this out. I know I am. Oh, pfft. Sure, hit me with a homing missile after I come in second place. You know, just add to more... Uh, kick me when I'm down, I think that's the expression I'm looking for. Alright, I'm up to six minutes and I'm still on the first race. That's just... Oh my god. I seriously don't remember this one being bad at all. Apparently I was mistaken, though. Alright, normally I'd be in second by this point, that's just the position I'd stay at for, for the entire race, but I'm doing a little bit better, at least. Oh, but I'm looking down at that mini-map, and it doesn't look very promising. It looks pretty tightly packed. Let's see if I can, I... can I get all the silver coins on, like, the first lap? That would be really nice. I don't remember if there's, like, any that you, like, have to miss on the first lap. I don't think there are. Oh no, there is that one like at the very, very beginning because you can't turn that sharply into the windmill to get it. I know I've tried that before and it just did not pan out well. I remember trying that like over and over again, trying to like right off the bat get this one in here, but I would always just hit the windmill and I would always end up in eighth place. Like it never failed. I would just end up in eighth place every single time. <laughs> it was really sad actually. Alright, so that wasn't so hard, was it? Yes, yes it was. Now we just gotta win, which shouldn't be too difficult, I don't think. I'm decently far ahead. Look at that, now I can see Bumper in like 7th or 6th place back there. Yeah, Bumper's the yellow dot. Remember that? Oh, yeah. What was I talking about? I was talking about how like the summer is like been, it's been really lax lately. Oh, yeah, it actually, like, there's been really nothing exciting. I don't even have, like, a summer job, which my parents wanted me to get one, but I was just like, ugh. I can't, like, juggle, like, a job and my own social life and then LPing thrown in with that. It's just too much to handle, man. Too much to handle. LPing itself is, like, just such a big thing to handle because it's so time-consuming. It's really fun. Like, this recording process, this is awesome. But the editing and the rendering and the uploading, ugh. It's just like the hours that I've spent putting into this. It like makes it worth it, cause like you guys really like this stuff. Not sure why, but you do. I shouldn't have gone for the zipper. But... Oh well, it doesn't really matter. I'm far enough ahead that I'm gonna win anyways. Yeah, it does make it all worth it though. So thanks for that. Oh yeah, but I can't wait for like Pax, uh, Pax Prime. It's gonna be in late August. Oh, because that's going to be pretty much the highlight of my summer, I'm telling you. All right, Greenwood, I'm going to save Greenwood Village for last, actually. I'll t did I ever seriously forget to turn off the volume on my phone? I just heard a beep over there. Yeah, I'm going to save Greenwood Village for last, because, you know, it's like save the best for last. Even though it's not the best, it's the worst. But it's going to be the best for, like, video purposes. Because, you know, people just love to watch the fail. They, like, get off on it. <laughs> you don't get off on it, but you know what I mean. Or yeah, this one's not too bad. Not really at all. <laughs> voice crack. Can't remember the last time I had a voice crack, to be honest with you. Whoa, okay, what are you doing? I just like a total like Z pattern there. Like I went all the way to one side of the tunnel, and I went all the way to the other side of the tunnel. Yeah. Okay, there is a silver coin here. There's two silver coins in here, that's right. It's crazy. Dude, what are you doing? Dude! Dude, seriously? I just <laughs> It just launched me to fifth freaking place. How? That was dumb. That was so dumb, Beyon. Wow, I can't believe it. Just that freaking log, I tell ya. Like, right when you get out of those passages, like those sewer passages, the EU passages, it's just like. It's the freaking logs that just mess you up so much if you hit them. Sometimes they don't. Like, sometimes you, like, launch clear over them if you get them at just the right position and angle and stuff. But most of the time, you just get screwed out of your mind. Alright, I think I can still, like, catch up and win this, though, because I see Diddy up, he up ahead in first there. It's always these three that are, like, right ahead of me. It's Diddy, Conquer, and, uh... 
bumper. That's it. Dude, that it happened again. It happened again. Dude! Oh my god! <laughs> I'm still missing a silver coin too. That's a big thing. Okay. Yeah, I like getting that zipper like right above that little that tiny little cliff there. Oh, there's that silver coin. Well, I'm not gonna win this anyway, so I might as well I might as well just restart. Yeah, but I like. I'll tell. I'll talk about that when we go around again. Oh, this, this freaking video is gonna be a bitch to edit. I'm up to like 10 minutes here, almost 11 minutes, and I, I'm on like the second race. Just ass, man. I told you. I told you this is gonna be like the most brutal section of the game. I didn't lie. I cannot tell a lie. Of course, you can tell a lie. You just choose not to. Yeah, so there's no uh, there's no silver coins in that other passage that you can take out of here, just in this lower one. All right, go around these logs, because you don't want to get screwed up there again. All right, two more coins left. All right, remember where one of them is, because the one I missed last time it's right over here. But where's the last? I think it's actually around this. Yeah, it's around this log, around the other side of this log. It's a really optical illusion-y, too, because, like, it looks like from, like, when you're approaching it, it looks like it's just touching the other side of the log, but it's actually, like, a few, like, a meter past the side of the log. So it's, like, you think that you're going to hit the log, and you might, like, turn too early or something. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. It's always just me, you know. All these weird thoughts that go through my mind. Oh, oh Yeah. Yeah, I like that one zipper, that zipper that I just went through. I like it because sometimes you can, like, go over there, or, like, go through that zipper, and you'll launch over, and you'll land right in front of that log, and the log will be, like, lateral to you, or parallel to you, or whatever it is. It's, like, perpendicular to your direction of motion, and then you'll, like, sail, like, right underneath it. It's so awesome. <laughs> I lifted up the drawbridge. Wait, what? How? They're supposed to, like, fall into the river if they lift up the drawbridge, but it looks like they just, like, sail clean over it. Whatever, man. Okay. And we win! Man, I tell you, I never get tired of that winning theme. Alright, so let's go ahead and do the Haunted Woods here. These aren't too bad either. Haunted Woods. Oh, yeah. In fact, I think these... I think this might be the second easiest one. Or Windmill Plains is, like, the second hardest one. And then, obviously, Greenwood Village is the hardest one by, like, a long... <laughs> by a lot. It's the hardest one by a lot, I tell you. There's not a silver... Yeah, there is a silver coin over here. And I got it, thankfully. Now I'm at fifth. I don't know. Was it worth it? Oh, yes, it was. Okay. Dude, oh, I did get that silver coin. Okay, I thought I missed that silver coin for sure. It was way too far to the right there to get it, but lo and behold, I did it. Right, Banjo, get out of my way. I don't want to fire this homing missile at you, because you're, you're like so close that it's not even worth it. I want to like get past you and shoot it at Conquer like that. Alright, whoa. Someone just honked outside, or maybe that was me. Dude! Diddy! What the hell? That was such an ass move! Just, oh my god. I forgot that the computers could be that dickish. I think the computers, like, they, like, legitimately try to stack up their balloons, like, three of the same color. Because it always seems like they have, like, one of the three different... Or, like, one of the different power-ups with, like, three... Like, they always have, like, the balloon, or the bubble. I missed that silver coin, I know, but I'm not going to win this anyways, so who really cares? Yeah. Uh, I feel, like, so cheap whenever I just, like, go into, like, restart the race. Like, I go into the pause menu and choose restart race. It feels like, well, I'm already, like, I should just, like, lose with honor or something. Instead of just, like, saying, okay, well, I'm going to restart the race, so that way I don't lose. So technically, I never lost, I won. Just I don't know, man. Just shut up. You're not making any sense today, man. You s seriously aren't. You seriously aren't. Now you're talking to yourself in the third person. What are you doing? Actually, you're talking to yourself in the second person, not the third person. The second person is the one that nobody cares about, really. 
It's like the Luigi of the three, like, person things. Because everyone knows, like, first person, because there's, like, first person shooters, so you have to know those. Otherwise, you're like... Because, look, I don't know, you just do. And then there's third person, which is obviously, like, you're talking, to, like, about someone else or something. Right, I got that silver coin awesome. But then there's second person, hardly ev anyone ever knows what that is. And you, like, rarely ever see, like, a book written in second person. It's always, like, first or third person. Second person is basically when you're referring to, like, when you're, like, speaking, like, directly to the person. Where you're, like, saying, like, you. <sighs> yeah. Alright, I'm up to 16 minutes here, but I'm probably going to cut some of that out, too. So I might actually have time to do Greenwood Village, but that's only if I get lucky here. Uh, you know what? Actually, I'm just going to call it a video. And we'll do Greenwood Village and the Smoky Race all in one video. So, <laughs> that's going to be one fun video. So, until then, thanks everyone for watching. This is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.